All right, guys, I'm on my return trip after I got abruptly cut off for no reason because it happens sometimes. But, you know, I, keep in mind, I just left my house, went for a quick trip. Talking about how very strange this sky is tonight, which it is. But in the meantime, I was just rambling away on my other video and all of a sudden I was like, you're done. You're done. You're sitting there talking to yourself. You're kind of silly. So, yeah, it always feels good to do that. Love it. Although I'm honestly, seriously still sitting here talking to myself if you want to really like get down to the nitty gritty there. So. so anyways, we're going back and I was in the middle of saying how much I appreciate you guys and how bad I get brain fog sometimes so much so that I forget things a lot like taking my daughter to her physical therapy appointments sometimes because there's so many because she's having progressive physical therapy. But today I got ahead of myself, drove all the way to Katy, Texas. Dropped my daughter off, she walked in, and then like three minutes later, she's like, uh, mommy, we're here on the wrong day. So, <laughs> I guess I, I sometimes like don't just forget, sometimes I like, I'm a little premature, so. So with that said, y'all just forgive me and bear with me. Sometimes if I forget like the names, cause I do have a hard time with the memory and the brain fog due to this disease. So I used to, <laughs> used to be really, really sharp, believe it or not never missed a beat didn't forget a thing and now i'm like man do i have part timers or all timers right now i'm not really sure but it's not really a joke because that actually does run in my family on both sides but i mean i know that mine isn't that it's not like on a dementia level it's on a um something is in my body that shouldn't be their level but i am trying so hard to delete these things that should not be here actually within any of us I mean she's did I mention that that big building on the other side of the road adjacent to my brother's shop is it they they, they make fluoride <laughs> so imagine just imagine I mean we all know about strong teeth healthy bones right yeah right just like the COVID vaccine I'm sorry um <clears throat> that was like I coughed a little the, the, <clears throat> the vaccine and I faxed a nation. That's I faxed a nation that coughed and va uh, faxed a nation thing. Yeah, it's all there for our good, guys. It's just doing us all well. Doesn't mean the heart's gonna be the best thing ever. Like, you're gonna have no memory thought process left, by the way. That's what it's basically saying. Actually, it doesn't say a word, it doesn't speak, but I did. I spoke. So, that's kind of what's coming. And I understand, I get it, people like are on the fence on whether they should receive or not receive that fax to the nation. But I would tell you, I don't think I ever want to send any fax to any nation because I don't want any more DNA manipulation, if that makes sense. Because you all can clearly see with what's happening to myself and my body that it's very real and it's very evident and it's very there. So, you know, get a few more people on board by faxing a nation on top of taking your daily fluoride because it's good for your teeth and builds healthy bones. And, you know, especially, you know, I mean, why not? Go ahead and give your kids the HPOMG V shot, which they didn't have when we were growing up. But, you know, they asked me last time, this last time, they're like, well, we need to give her that. I'm like, no. No, you don't, and no, you won't, and it's not gonna 